I'm really excited. Um, so many reasons. I would have liked you to see my face, but then I'm still setting up some rigs to be able to make that possible. But in the interim, I'm going to be showing you my screen and how much progress we've been able to make regarding our RPA. I told you guys, this is the way, this is the next big thing. This is how we can improve our earnings. This is how we can make AdSense, you know, work for us. And today I'm going to be showing you how the entire system works. We have created a system that is capable of switching user agents, personalities, um, cookies, devices, screen height. A system that is capable of clicking on ads, skipping ads, fast forwarding and pausing videos, just like a real human being would. Now you might wonder, how does all this thing works? I made it very plain from the start that I'm not going to take credit for, you know, designing the entire system by myself. I made it very clear that I bought a simple board system and I remodeled it. I got a group of, you know, guys who are expert at um, JavaScript and we're able to put our minds together to be able to create something that works for our specific purpose. So I've made that very clear because I try to be very honest with you guys. I'm not going to take credit for something that I did not do. But in the things that I did, I'm going to list them out. So right now, I've made the RPA capable of um, having our cookies. Made the RPA capable of changing locations with our proxies. Made it capable of um, clicking on advertisement for you, right? So it can load up any website that you so want it to load or whatever it is that you want it to do. The RPA is capable of doing that by itself, right? I'm not going to be giving you a demo on how it works. So let me just clear this. All right. So I'm going to be showing you guys how it works with two separate cookies so that you would see how the whole concept of changing cookies uh at intervals or after a particular time to be able to mimic thousands of people who are visiting your website is going to be possible all right so the first cookie i'm going to be using is that of adsense for all you must be familiar with my email address adsense for all at gmail.com and then i was just going to log in that so that i would see how it goes and then this is going to be the device height by the way we're using an iphone you're going to see it right here with um, Hua. So it's going to load after loading. It's going to go to the specific link that you would like it to show. If you notice the A here, that means AdSense for all. And then the iOS device, our default operating system. This is my desktop, by the way. You can see this is Windows, right? So you can see that it's loading in this particular um, device screen height. So this is what an iPhone device screen height looks like. So now it's done. So it's just going to scroll down, keep scrolling. So imagine this is your website. It's going to keep scrolling and scrolling through reading the content and though it's a real human beings. The joy about this particular system is that you can perform internal link clicks. If you can see my face right now, I'm smiling. Because all of these things, if you're my student, I've taught you a lot of these things and you, you know how tedious it can be. And this is a system doing everything. My hands are up. I'm not typing anything. I'm not pressing any downward arrow keys to prove my point. If I scroll it up, it's going to scroll it down. Oops, I think that is, that's about a time. So let me just reload it again. So it's type in the name of the site so this is you're going to be a website definitely so i just wanted to scroll down then you would see so it's scrolling now so if i try to scroll it back up it's going to keep scrolling down right because it has a particular tax remember it's an rp and i've taught you what an rp means a robotic process automation it's doing what i said it should do so if well configured because the whole configuration process is what I'm trying to create, take my time so that you don't mess things up. 
so let's load that with a different cookies and then let's see how it's gonna go okay so i'm just gonna um, close this and i'm gonna log out i've taught you guys how to extract cookies so i'm gonna log out of my adsense i'm just gonna be using this um my other email address that's blister eternal so i'll just log into blister eternal it's gonna ask me for my password um let's see all right so i've loaded google.com let me just extract my cookies i've told you guys if you're part of my student now you would have seen how to do this so this is my cookies and i'm just gonna copy it okay and after doing that i'm just gonna bring it down here and then change it right these are very sensitive files by the way you want to try as much as possible to make sure that you keep all of this secured all right if we look at the rpa if you notice that's a different this is a different account right here you can say this titano right this just tells you everything our system is working imagine the things that we can do so be excited get yourself ready and i hope to see you in the next update